Uh, in theory of automation, we talk of the automation pyramid, which is factory level, goes down to PLC level, and then the sensor actuator level. And the goal of IO-Link is to communicate between the sensor level, sensor actuator level on the bottom, which is inductive sensors, photoelectric sensors, all kind of sensors, and also actuators like pneumatic cylinders, and the communication to the PLC level. The PLC is the brain of the machine, and the PLC controls the machine in their production processes. Typically, um, these machines have a bus system in communication, like in this example with Ethernet IP, um, which is based on technology of Rockwell, which is quite a standard in the uh, NAFTA market and also in Latin America. Uh, Rockwell is um, strong in this industry of packaging, and Baluf addresses the communication between sensor actuator level to the PLC level. For example here, you find some sensors uh, which communicate via, via a sensor hub, we call, to the and then by I.O. link to the bus mast, a bus system with Ethernet IP, which communicates then to the PLC. With this kind of topology, it's easy to communicate from the sensor level to the PLC, and it's also a very cost-effective way of communicating um, in the, the topology which it provides. The wiring of this is standard, three-wire cable, three, four wire cable M12, which is very cost effective. And uh, the advantage of IO Link is it's also that it communicates both ways. Not only information from the sensor to the PLC, it, there's also the possibility to provide um, diagnosis functions from the sensor and also parametrization down from the PLC to the specific sensor. Especially in packaging industry, it's quite relevant that you have a fast format change available. Every second, every several hours, the format of the products is changed because there are so different kinds of, of packaging um, marketing aspects, and the format will changed will be needed to be changed very fast. And with the packaging, with this I/O link concept, you can address this format change quite well and quite fast within rather some minutes compared to in the past with several uh, hours of, of changing. IO-Link is the adequate communication system from the sensor level to the PLC in packaging industry. The machines in packaging industry need to be um, quite fast and with a very high availability, with low downtime and, and a high reliability. For this, these diagnostic functions um, are used in the IO-Link concept. It has solutions in machine builder OEMs in America, in Europe, and um, with this IO-Link BNIs, we communicate uh, in a fast manner to the, to the PLC. Um, the solutions are in addressed to two, to two um, areas. One is the end-user area, we have applications where end users, big end users, uh, modified their infrastructure and changed from uh, binary wiring, which they had classically, to I.O. link, even within one weekend. So um, they quickly uh, modified their concept to a new infrastructure, which allows the configuration and parametrization of the whole installation, as well as addresses diagnostic functions. This is the end user approach, which can be done with IO Link. And then the machine builder approach shows the possibility to um, reduce the total cost of ownership of a machine by this new kind of infrastructure. Wiring, for example, starts uh, very easily with a, a standard wiring, which is a standard and therefore economical. The sensors are more and more standardized also. IO-Link is an international IEC standard, which offers to the user um, the, uh, to be sure that it's a future subject, which will be even in 20 years available because it's internationally standardized. Uh, many companies in the industry of um, sensors and actuators are in the IO-Link, we say in Germany consortium, in the IO-Link um, 
organization. And more and more products are available with the I.O. link concept. For the migration process, uh, Baluf also offers systems uh, like hubs where you can change from analog signal, which has been used in the past, 0 to 10 volts, for example, uh, with such a connector and such a hub, hub we call it, with such a hobbit, uh, where you can change to I.O. link signals, in this case 14-bit, which is very uh, accurate and precise, so you can even in older installations, you can adapt and migrate in an easy way to the new I.O. link concept. This smart light um, offers a signaling of the machine status over, over long, long range of distances with different colors, which can be parametrized, and with a only three-wire cable, which is quite relevant. And you have different levels of, of, of signal Link which are only addressed via the I.O. link signal. Uh, I tell you, this product is really strong in the market and we get a lot of attraction with this.